It's apparently that, <coughs> even though I streamed it last week, it's apparently that old that uh, it won't show up on the display capture again. Or the uh, full screen capture. Yes, I, my brain is just dead. <laughs> so it's great to be playing a puzzle game. World of Goo is um, an interesting game, let's put it that way. Um, I did. I've played Little Inferno before, which is another one of the games that this company has made. And essentially, it's about linking goo balls to the point where it finishes the puzzle. Let's see what we've got this time. What does the sign say? They look the same to me. Hmm. Goo racism. That's always a good place to start. <coughs> So, kind of like make the uh, the goo kind of do stuff like this, so I can connect the next set of goo. Uh, but there are specific goo which will do other things. <coughs> and there's also like other little bits and challenges you can do. Uh, with this, you just got to get all the goo balls, all the like specific goo balls, into a specific place. This one's not work, so let's remove you and create just like you know some sort of strange penis-like concoction that may work or not work. I'm not entirely certain. This this game is literally just physics engine the puzzle. You can phys oop. if you can figure it out, it's fine. If you can't, well, sucks to be you. Oh. Sign of life, sign of life. Get on the little ranch, off you go. And then I've got to build up the next one, and then put them in the pipe up there. So let's take you lot and you know, just kind of. With wild abandon, realise that you cannot phase them through solid objects and forget that that's even a thing. So you just kind of, you know, let them fall to the ground. Made entirely of balls. I don't know if I actually call Little Inferno as um, a game to replay at some point, but I may do so anyway. Like, if this gets to the point where my brain is like, oh, please stop nursing, um, I will, like, load up Little Inferno and show people what that's like. Because it's the same sort of art style anyway. No, no, no. Yeah. I don't want to use the black ones. Not yet. Oh. Okay. That That's now just... This wouldn't be one of my streams without something like this happening, would it? That goo ball is now stuck in the wall.
There we go. Don't know if I got out. Good. Um, let's start building up towards the uh, the roof. And uh, what's flying around is uh, time flies. They are basically retries that you can use if you make a mistake or a mess. In this case, I don't think I'm going to need them unless I mean seriously overbalances, uh, which I feel like is happening right here, right now. Yep. Not surprised. Oh, hey, Zeke, how's it going? Let's see, uh... Goop. Goop doing things. Uh, I may have to move back a bit. On this one before it kind of toppled over. Yeah, World of Goo. World of Goo is a... A strange puzzle game, which um, I think this was like the entire studio's pitch to like making games in the first place. They made um, another game called Little Inferno, um, one which I may show off if. Um, can can these goo balls actually, you know, kind of stay on the seesaw here? I mean, I have this like influence, this like very strange influence on people that I will just kind of play games and everyone's like, oh, you know, I've never played this before, or I'll, I'll buy this now, and I don't understand why. But I, honestly, I'd prefer Little Inferno to be bought, because it's actually kind of fun. It's like not particularly a big puzzle game. This one's a bit weirder. Oh, I have to do the goo tower. Oh, no. So this one I tried, I think, last stream that I did when I played Spelunky. I have to get... Well, oh, game's a bit louder than I am. And because of the way this is programmed, it will... Oh, no. Uh, because of the way this game is programmed entirely in a physics engine, you have to get them up here. <laughs> you have to get them up there. And the last time I streamed it, I didn't have enough goo balls, and then the whole tower collapsed. It's great. It's what I consider fun, as in, uh, you know, F-U-C-K level of fun. Also, the, the way the goo moves, uh, it moves in such a strange way that the physics engine can't keep up with it. Because it's constantly shifting around. Yeah, it's starting to do it now. It's starting to sort of like lean over in a way I don't want. And I've still gotta I still gotta make quite a few moves <laughs> to get it up there. She may go over. There may be a case of timber here.
supposed to get this up there? Oh, I think it's about to fall over. Yeah, that, that's not looking too healthy. Uh-oh. This is, uh... I don't think I've got enough balls left either. I think. Four point five meters to go. And it is uh, looking decidedly dicey. Because I don't know how this <laughs> I don't know how this physics tower is going to work after about maybe uh, the next five turns. <laughs> Fuck, come on man. No 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 please no. Please no. <laughs> yeah, you basically have to uh, like stack all of these balls together to actually reach the top. Yeah, this is such a weird game. Jenga but with goo. Well, this level particularly is. And I think the my structure is about to collapse in on itself. As you can see, it is swaying quite heavily. And it's collapsed. Like, there is wind physics here, and that's what's fucking with me. And anything that gets knocked off my tower is just becomes a problem. Like, look at it fucking go! It is now swaying back and forth like it's a drunkard. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. Um. This physics engine was never particularly smart. Just, uh, this um, physics engine was never particularly smart. This is why I prefer Little Inferno. Because it actually doesn't challenge you to do stuff like this. Oh, it's about to fall over again. Because I think there's like a draft blowing in one direction as well. Which also is like messing with my tower. Not only do you have to build it up there, you also have to, like, keep it to the point where you can... Uh oh No, 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 Oops, he's dying. Just take two shots back. Um, uh oh It's about to fall over again. Yep. 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 <laughs> Come on! This is a physics engine that does not give two shits about what you're doing. Oop, oh, okay. and there we go, just lost a bunch more. <laughs> there it goes! And part of my structure snapped. Fuck, man. Come on. And because of how this physics engine behaves, it will just destroy itself. There we go. I've just got to wait for it to settle. 
And asking this physics engine to settle is a very bad idea. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. I also don't know if I lose goo by doing this. And now it's going to sway to the left. Well, at this point, I'm literally debating just loading up World of uh, uh, Little Inferno and just playing that instead. Because <laughs> this, this puzzle sucks. It's not the only time that this game also does this. Um, I think one of the later stages invites you to play with water physics. So, I gotta really think about what I'm doing here. Yeah, this is not going well. That's why you've got these time flies to like, try and make sense of this. Remember, I've got to make this stable before they can actually finish the... If I don't, ma if I don't stabilize this, uh, everything's about to, like, go to shit. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going back further. There it goes. Just completely collapses. You know what, let's play Little Inferno instead. <laughs> oh no, I can skip the level, I don't care. It's not one I particularly enjoy. Um, you only have a certain number of moves that you can make with the goo, otherwise afterwards it'll start, like, pulling apart. And you won't have enough uh, to get to the end of the stage and complete it. So it's it's really strange about how it wants you to do things. Like this is definitely a physics engine based game, but it doesn't quite realise what it wants to do. So if you can skip stages, I'm all for it. Especially if it's one that I'm just like, eh, hey, you know what, this is actually kind of Like, one of my weakest genres is puzzles. I hate puzzle games. No, I think there's not too many puzzle games I'm particularly enjoy. I like Portal because it's a perspective puzzle game rather than some other stuff. Um, what's the other one called? Anti- um, It's called Antimat- What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Antimatter is also good. Have I tried winning? No. No, that's completely out of my jurisdiction. I'm sorry.
but then this is also trying to get the physics engine to behave. Which, as you can see, this was a fine structure. And it didn't want to do anything, because this is the other problem we have here. This goo just keeps moving back and forth, and it adds weight to every structure. Um, it makes it more difficult, because you have to fight two sets of physics. Yep, there we go. The uh, structure has just snapped and broken. <laughs> then it does just it does this on its own. You j can do basically nothing, and it will just kill itself. But this ain't no poly bridge in which shit makes sense. Yeah, there we go, it's collapsed again. <laughs> uh. Remember, there's also extra challenges that you can do, if you so wish. And there it goes. <laughs> but the weird thing is, this came out sort of the same period of time as De Blob did. But it's less well known. Well, fuck you too, physics engine. <laughs> yeah, the. Yes, yeah, I, I have to admit, the physics engine doesn't quite work in a way it should. <laughs> Like, look at this, and it was f perfectly fine to stand up on this, like, ridge here, and then it's just broken. <laughs> like, I do like the fact that this game gives you the option to skip. Um, Puddle was also like this, but Puddle also had um, issues, other issues. And over it goes. Yeah, there it goes. I can sort of, like, predict how most of my structures are going to go at this point. <laughs> like, you know, if I could make an ode to the giant penis in the sky, I probably would. <laughs>
I think this is, should be a game I shouldn't stream and should do in my own time. <laughs> Because uh, I think as we've just demonstrated in like maybe the short 20 minutes that I've been... Is it 20? No, 30 minutes I've been streaming this. Uh, I've already written, made several structures that have fallen over and destroyed themselves. So let's go play Little Inferno. Let's go show that. Not sure Little Inferno. Because I think that's probably like, considering how brain tired I am... Probably a better idea. There is Little Inferno. It's not particularly big down there, thank goodness, but... Yeah, the, um... The soundtrack for World of Goo is actually pretty good. Just unfortunate that I'm not going to be able to do that. That's no, definitely not a stream game for me. It just... I just can't make it work properly in my favour sometimes. Right, let's show this then. Warning, do not play with fire. No shit. <laughs> so this is still the same people that made World of Goo. Can I start this again, or do I need to... Yeah, that's that's my completed. That's my completed file. Which shows, because I have all combinations. <clears throat> so, yeah, let's, let's start this one again. Let's play this one. Touch and hold anywhere to make a fire. Yeah, just burn that. Fuck that. <laughs> Oh. Congratulations on the legitimate purchase of your new Little Inferno ent Entertainment Fireplace. We've lovingly crafted each fireplace to warm your home and your heart. Stay warm in there. Mmm. Wee! Love, Miss Nancy. Tomorrow, Corporation. Well, uh, fuck that. We'll just burn that. <laughs> uh, terms and conditions? Ah, uh, you know what? Fuck that, too. Uh, there's a little bit of paper there. Yeah, fuck that. There's another one here. Uh, just fuck that, you know. Don't need the dossier. Fuck that. <laughs> Goodness! Have you already burned all your things? That's okay. You can always buy more. With your brand new... Catalogue! <laughs> Love, Miss Nancy. You got a catalogue! Letter blocks. Corn on the cob! Little Inferno collector poster. Oh, I love that. Mm. Just call him. Put that in as well. I'm gonna just burn everything. Yeah, you can just burn it, move it around. Like burn everything. It's fine. Uh, you see, you see this poster? Yeah. Just throw that in there. I'll throw in these like little child blocks that have uh, two E's, T, and a G. You know that just means git. Uh, and then you just burn it. It's fine, including this thing. Let's just squish that. Um, yeah, you can just kind of move it around, you know, pick up this stuff, uh, money. Uh, just put some corn in there, we need to eat. <laughs> you can't actually put the catalogue in the fire saddle. Uh, you know, just buy a clock, uh, you know, buy someone else's credit card. Uh, here's a broken magnet. Uh, you know, I don't think my fireplace is on fire enough yet. You're doing so great, but don't worry. Your little inferno is not like other games. There are no points. There is no score. You are not being timed. Just make a nice fire. And stay warm in the glow of your high-definition entertainment product. 
But you can't do that forever. There is bound to be an end. Stay warm, Miss Dancy. Ah, I don't give a shit, Miss Dancy. Just throw that in there. You go. You have the broken magnet. Somebody else's fucking credit card. It's not my problem. Here's a clock. Uh, <laughs> hello? Is there anybody there? You don't know me, but I thought I would tell you. It's so cold outside. I'll we'll stog it up and turn in front of my little inferno entertainment fireplace. It's so toasty, I can stay here forever. Like a hug in a bug in a mug. I mean, a bug in a mug in a bug. From Sugar Plums. This is for you. <laughs> uh, you know, here's a picture. Let's just, you know, let's just burn that as well. Fuck it. You know, be the monster. Burn everything. You know, just, just watch it all happen. I'm trying to remember most of these combos. I've done them before, but I can't be bothered. Uh, what's this? Uh, sleeping idol. Yeah, just put that in there. This battery pack. You know, fuck that. Uh, you know, put so more more credit cards in there. Fuck it. <laughs> I literally the whole point of the game is to make as much combinations until the game says stop. Um. Yeah, let's just put a tiki idol in there. Just watch it. You know. Sing itself, yeah. You know, throw batteries in it, you know. Just, yeah, you know, fuck that. Just fucking throw that in there. <laughs> I'm 12. This is a uh, little inferno. This is the game I was like, you know what? I'm bored. Let's just throw, you know, someone else's credit card in there. Um, you know, here's an ordinary brick. Fuck that. There's a torch. Uh, here's a wooden bicycle. Uh, you know, here's a toy pirate. <laughs> like I. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Just throwing out someone else's money. It's uh, all this money. Just burn it. Like, this is why I love the indie gaming sphere. There's so many weird games that you can find. Uh, it's just put a torch in there. You know, that's fine. Here's a pirate. You know, he's just sitting there. Just put, just, just give him the bike. You know, take this bike. Let's just fuck around until he just smacks smack into death with a bike. Uh, let's put. A, yeah, we'll just bury him. Here's some brick. Here's some bricks. You know, just, I take a brick, and and then we burn it. We burn everything. There's the pirate bike combo. Hello, it's me again. It smells like something's burning. Did you get a little inferno fireplace too? It seems like everyone has one these days. Everyone I know has one, and everyone I don't know has one too. Burning stuff is pretty fun, but be careful. The instruction said that there's something more dangerous than fire, but I burned them. So we'll never know. From you and your friend, Sugar Plums. No, you know, I don't care. <laughs> I think the pirate might be on fire. Do you think the pirate might be on fire? Someone else's family portrait. You know, just stick that in there with the credit card. Fuck it. Uh, instant C packet. Uh, you got some fireflies. <laughs> it's such a silly game, but I love it. Spider, kill it. Uh, yeah, pirate bike combo is pirate plus bike. Uh, let's let's put this nice picture of a family in there. Look at that, and we'll put the credit card on top. Look at that, you know. This could be their credit card. You don't know. I've already burned my stuff. Will you send me something? I need some fireflies. I actually have it. There you go. Message sent. Uh, we'll put some seeds in there. You know. Got to have some nice sunflower seed stuff, and uh, there we go. Someone else's stuff. Not my problem. Everything's on fire. Uh, what have we got there? We've got some pictures. Yeah. Oh shit! I can actually go through my own pictures. I can burn other people. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> we have so many options here. You know, let's just burn a bunny butt. That's fine. 
an egg. Oh, we have the second recall toys. Find one more combo. Okay, thanks for your new fireflies. <laughs> Every, each one was like a little wish. I set them free to see where they would go. But they all burned up. We knew they wouldn't last forever. Oh, got something. Okay, it's attached. Just flip over the letter. Flip it. And again. Here it is. Here's a box. She gave me a paper heart. Uh, yeah, let's put the bunny butt in there. Just watch it burn. <laughs> what? Little Inferno is filled with secrets, and I just found one. Oh, I won't tell you. That would be a spoiler. But it's really good. Okay, I'm just going to draw something here. Oh, yeah. Clock plus seed flowers. Yeah, um, I have... If you pick the pictures... Let me let me show it here. Um, I just need to buy everything first. That and the clock. Oh, please dispose of your belongings. Sorry, I got too excited. Uh, let's just put the spiders in there. Oh, I've already read there. So I don't need the alarm clock. So, if I buy the My Pictures thing, you can go through, like, there's some stock photos, and then you can go through what's saved on your files. And uh, one of the ones that I burned was Fran Cake, in which I put Fran <laughs> Fran's ass on a cake. I mean, what else can I burn here? There's a decent set of my pick. That's a shotgun tits. I can't remember why I made shotgun tits. But the amount of stuff that I've edited gives me a wealth of things. It, you know what? Let's just burn the Jenny Care Bear. It's fine. So, clock plus that. Springtime combo. And we'll set fire to the uh, to those. Yeah, let's let's set fire to the Care Bear Bunny. Uh, not Care Bear Bunny. Care Bear Jenny. Just burn her alive. It's fine. I'm sure she'll survive. Give me my second catalog. Oh, I need to purchase everything in the first catalogue. Television, blankety blank. I think it's that plus credit card is another one. Celebration bus. <coughs> the only problem is the uh, the um, The TV is very expensive in this one. It's 40, 40 cents. And by the time you get to the end of the uh, the game, you have so much money and so many combination possibilities that you have to kind of just, like, figure it out. After a while, you just get bored and look it up. Also, when I first played this, the achievements weren't working properly, so I might get a few more. So, uh, let's put the let's put a bank in there, you know. Put the credit card on top. Squish that spider. Uh, we got a bus. Uh, lenders. I forget what the generations one is. So yeah, I mean, I could burn, I could burn the people that I am trying to negotiate with. I could burn the Mal the uh, Marlboro burger. I could burn the full body condoms. <laughs> I could burn 
this anime. I could burn Superman 64. <laughs> I could set fire to uh, Jenny Bot Christ Anthem. Uh, I could burn the BC. <laughs> That's a whole lot of Jenny. It is. I missed the end, by the way. I could burn uh, the BC error screen that I made. Uh, we could burn Frowny Bot. We could burn the fact that someone's missing a nose. We could burn Kefka holding a pizza. We could burn Case cooking. Uh... <laughs> we could burn Yoshi Bot. Unfortunately, gifts don't work properly, so I can't burn this one properly. Oh, of course, now it's going to. Let's just burn this look of apps. <laughs> burn K. All right. Let's uh, burn this one. <clears throat> Let's wait for it to arrive first before we put the bus on. There's, there's, I think at this point, because we stopped playing World of Goo, we're just, like, taking it easy with this. I think I could beat it in the time it takes to finish the stream, but... Yeah, there we go. There we go. I don't think Zeke's seen this one, so we'll leave it on screen for a minute if he's still here. <laughs> the level of shit posting I have done. <laughs> It's why I think Jenny regrets. <laughs> it's why I think Jenny regrets. Um, <laughs> so I, I have a feeling she goes to bed every so often. It's like, why did I fucking let this guy do editing for me? Alright, time to burn everything. <laughs> and the bus explodes. Uh, Generations, I can't remember what that one is off the top of my head. I think it's the television and the family portrait. And then I have to save up enough money from everything that I'm doing to, um, to buy the next catalogue. Also, the game makes sure that you never run out of money. Like, the little eyeball spiders are like, yeah, here, have this. <coughs> Breaking weather report. It's going to be another cold one, folks. The snow's been coming down faster and faster. Every day colder than the last. I can't last forever. <laughs> Build a nice cozy fire and stay in, stay warm inside, folks. Boarding from the weather balloon. Over the smokestacks. Over the city. The weatherman. Well, fuck you. Your letter's only good for burning. <laughs> and the more expensive items that you get until, like, they reveal the ticket stuff means that you, it's going to take a while to get certain things. Right, television. Let's put that somebody's photo in front of that television. No, it's a television of, of what I'm doing here. Let's see if it catches on fire. Yeah, that uh, looks fine to me. <laughs> there we go. New catalogue. <coughs> totally recalled toys. Space heater, squirrel whistle. Uh, I think that's all I can buy for the minute. A raccoon plushie. Uh, let's put the space heater in there. Squirrel whistle. Uh, you got some fragile light bulbs. <laughs> Fuck! I may have to keep like other things on. I think I need 
quite a lot of the combos to finish the the game. So, you know, let's just see. The glass glass doesn't catch fire, does it? No, of course it doesn't. Don't be silly. Oh, you've already found my second catalogue. Did you know? Your little inferno comes with a free instructional video. Love, Miss Nancy. Oh, okay, shit. Let's, um, let's show the, show the video. Hey, kids! Do you like toys? Yeah! You know what's more fun than playing with toys? Huh? Setting them on fire! With your new Little Inferno Entertainment Fireplace. Yeah! It's Little Inferno, it's Little Inferno just for me. I've got the fireplace that burns at 100 billion degrees. It's Little Inferno just for me. I've got these old toys. I've got this box of memories. We'll shove them in the fire and breathe in. Well, you're right. But up out of your chimney, way up in the sky, it's been snowing for years, and we just don't know why. Our world is getting colder, but there's no need for alarm. Just sit by your fire, burn all of your toys, and stay warm. <laughs> there you go. That's the instruction manual at that point, right? Raccoon, you know, space heater, fuck that, it's, it's his whistle. Fuck that, fuck that letter. No, burn it. My, pretty much my favourite game, even though it doesn't make any sense. Buy stuff, burn it. And it gives you more money than when you started. I love free stuff. I can't last forever. Oh, I hope they release a free update. Little Inferno Fireplace. With pink logs from sugar plums. Looks like a face, but it's not. It can see you. Well, that's wonderful information. Let's burn it. Uh, oh, good. Uh, where is it? Just chuck this over here somewhere. Don't take my dashboard away, thank you. <laughs> I think I've got the Jenny version of that one, Kefka. I can put, burn that photo. There we go. Let's give myself some extra items. Uh, I think it's the Eager Bunny plushie and the Feeling Spare is one of the combinations. I just need just a tiny fraction more money. Also, this fireplace never gets cleaned up. Look at this shit. <laughs> you sort of like fling it around, no one gives a crap. <laughs> There's the little spiders. Come on, I know you're there. There you are. Oh, good. That's enough for the bunny. <coughs> I think these, this is the terrible teeth combo. Let's just burn it. No, it's not. Mind. First one either. Okay. Uh, what have we got? Oil barge. 
We got some best friend supplement pills. Uh, building blocks. There we go. I think I need a brick for that. Uh, or is it functional basis? Uh, where is it? Building bricks. Yeah, that's just bricks, I think. Because you need enough, like, of these stars to unlock more st things, and some of them start getting a bit... Let's just put this one here, like, Mini Milky Way. No, it's not Mini Milky Way. Which one is it? Because I did all the combos once. There's one that was literally just a small orb, a small sun that you could do randomly, make a nuclear sun inside your fireplace. It's fine. There's the building bricks combo. <laughs> uh, what else is this doing here? Yeah. Oh, we got snake surprise. Take some pills and an oil barge. Why not? But I think you can only have a maximum of six items completely. So I have to kind of like get to the point where I'm buying the very expensive stuff. And I'll just put some pills in there and a oil barge. Look, there we go. It's just, you know, just oil casually spilling around in my fireplace. Everything's on fire, it's fine. I'm making you something because you are my pretty good friend. Even though you never reply to my letters. Okay, but you have to send me something first. Send me is red and attractive. Has long invisible arms. It's not love. Ew. It's magnets. Oh, I don't have that yet. I need to buy the uh, broken magnet. But there's also like a certain wind condition here as well that um, you have to just kind of figure it out on your own. But uh, disgruntled elf plushie. And there's a, a a dinosaur plushie that we can burn. <laughs> there you go. Have a magnet. Because everything you give to Sugar Plums basically is like all the items you need to finish this story. After that, it's just whatever you want to do. You know, let's just put some snakes in there. Eh, it's a little, a little crispy. Oh, there we go. It's uh, it's got some hypodermic needles in. Okay, thanks for the magnet. I can tell you there's something special about it. Do you not notice too? Wow. For making you something, I'm not very good at deadlines. You can have this for me now, I think it's broken. Thermometer! Well, let's burn that thermometer. <laughs> uh... I'm trying to remember, one of the combos involves the elf, and I can't remember which one it is. Set of bombs in this. Let's get the, the wandering eye. That's the cold metal heart. Um, I'm trying to think here. Like, I'm pretty certain I had all the combos at one stage, and I've completely forgotten them. Oh right, the heart and the uh, the space heater. I think it's the fan combo. Yeah, they, let's just play with all this weird hypodermic. Oh shit! Nobody move. 
I broke his needle. <laughs> this one seems to be still intact, and oh dear. <laughs> Double fan! Yeah, you can just have this camera as well. Hey, it sent me a picture. Let's burn that as well. Uh, what have we got? We have got Valkyrie doll, breaks hearts, and champagne glasses. <laughs> oh, right. The disgruntled elf has a bomb attached to it. I should have realised this. <laughs> uh, time bomb, I think, might be... Alarm clock plus disgruntled elf. <clears throat> mm -hmm. This is sort of like a relaxing game where I can just, you know, burn everything, be the monster. Uh, you know, there's a dinosaur in there. Uh, here's an elf, and here's a his bomb. Dynamite combo. Okay, that wasn't what I needed. There you go. Um. I don't know what movie night is. Yeah, Uncle Sam's Blam Blams. Anyone who doesn't light up a box of these is probably a terrorist. Oh, there we go. There's the thing. The toy leprechaun. That's the terrible teeth combo. Oh, yeah. We have, uh, like, a mini miniature nuke that you can just throw in the fire. <laughs> Oil barge and... Toy pirate is another one. All this is is about just like fucking around with the physics engine and then just doing stuff that you don't care about. But if you want to burn it, you can burn it. Uh, here's an oil barge with the toy pirates. Here, burn. Uh, you've both got terrible teeth. Burn for me. Please. Please, get off of my screen. <laughs> oh, Magnet and uh, Cold Hearts is probably another one. Mostly it just boils down into, hey, let's fuck around and find out what the, uh, all the combinations are. That's it. Uh, what are the other combinations I still need to find? Watching you... I think Time Bomb is just, um... Oh, that's on it. There's also a cat combo in here somewhere. Hard. It'll burn eventually. It's fine. <laughs> He's burned. <laughs> we have stumbled upon a Dark Souls boss in the middle of this. Uh, there's the cat. Kitty kitty poo poo plushy. Fills your heart with love and your home with fur. Mm. 
There we go. Part three. <clears throat> Another letter. Oh, I forgot. There was something I wanted to tell you. Are you there? Well, you know, I just gotta burn your letter now, it's fine. <laughs> I knew you were there. If me to tell you something, really, really ready? Okay, listen carefully. Shh, I'm your neighbor. I think I'm stuck here, just like you. You and me, and a little wall right between us. From your neighbor, sugar plums. Right, thanks, let me burn it. The elf uh, with a mini nuke on its head. Fuck this joint, blow everything up. Oh no way, it's time bomb. Well, uh, you know, <laughs> we also got a mini moon. Go on, mini nuke. Need you to be back in stock. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, it takes so long with some of these. It feels like a phone game when it's not. Oop, spider. Squeech. Damn it, mini nuke's still not in stock. Come on, give me my 10 seconds. Got a mini nuke again. <coughs> and it's got a camera and a clock. I like the fact that the eyes sort of track you where you are, and there's just set fire to things. Night is the one I'm struggling with, but I shouldn't be. Uh, time bomb, the cat I think I've got in there. Oh, we have mini nuke, okay. There's time bomb. And the lol kitty, yep. At least remember some of it. Uh, right, that's filled out that one. Uh, the other ones. Watching you combo. I think it's the watching, uh, the wandering eye, plus something else. Hmm. Breaking weather report. The forecast says, thick snow clouds are rolling in from all directions. We're in for something big. Stay warm inside, folks. Reporting from the weather balloon. Over the smokestacks, over the city, the weather man. Well, time to burn your letter, I don't care. Oh, there's Uncle Sam's blam blams. 
seems to be a crudely like the head seems to the hat seems to make sense but then it's just got like two stuck on pair of eyes and then uh, a mustache We have a mini moon that things can stick to and just kind of like generate the gravity of. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna quickly find the combo list. Alright, the, the f Damn! Oh, this game is on Google Play for five bucks. Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me. So, the Generations one is a spider egg and someone else's photo. Uh, the Movie Night one is popcorn plus TV. In fact, it's well worth the five dollars that this game actually is. It's just... Where'd the money go? Uh, once what did I buy? Okay, let's burn this set first. Let's get everything just kind of like moving. Uh, you know. There you go. Just burn it. There's the generations combo. And this one. Your TV. And the wandering eye. And that's another pair done and then I need enough money to be able to buy the next thing like it makes sense that it's so cheap but then it's also like this is a very old game it's this is one from 2012 so It would not surprise me that the game is still sort of really, really, uh, sort of, you know, just there. <coughs> right, while this is going on. And, like, this is a game I've played before and beat, uh, like, I've 100 percented most of it. Just the achievements weren't working. So, this, this, and this in there. And after a while it just becomes, like, looking up all the combos that you need. Movie night, and watching you. Got a dino here with a torch on its head. There's fire breather. Oh, that was all of them. I literally just couldn't remember three of them. No, four of them. Excuse me. New catalog. We've got a wooden spoon. Now with improve. Now with more splinters for improved spanking. Catfish, dinnerware, wake up, iced coffee, liquid diet, egg sac, freaked out food.
We even have a blowfish that you can put in your mouth if you so wish. This is a very sort of now chill stream because of what I'm playing. Uh, just put the dry ice in there, here's some marshmallows, you know, fuck it. I want some frozen marshmallows. Here's a puff fish that's going into the sky. Uh, some sausages. Ooh, is your fireplace keeping you warm? Do you know what's even cozier than a crackling fire? A hug! Attach the coupon for one free hug. You might need it one day. <laughs> Love, Miss Nancy. One free hug. Well, I couldn't give a shit about that. I need something to keep me warm, bitch. <laughs> the marshmallows are screaming. Blowfish kind of... There we go. Blowfish doing what it do. <laughs> Other marshmallows on fire. Uh, fragile China. Got some zesty beetles. Some tooth and corn breakfast flakes. Holy shit. Some discount sushi as well. Mmm, future fizz. And a toy exterminator. It's coffee time! No, it just says it's coffee time. That's it. <laughs> uh, I just need to remember what most of these are. Dinnerware, I think, is an easy one. It's... Ooh, spider. Pick that up. And as you get like buy more catalogues, the money that the free spider give the spider gives you is goes up constantly. Mm. Right, toy exterminator, throw that in. There's some cereal. Yeah, here's cereal and some drinks. Uh, just, there you go. Here's a Here's some discount sushi and some you know, nice zesty bugs. Yeah, just throw that on there. Hello, neighbor, are you still there? You're reading all my letters carefully, right? You're not just skipping through and, bur <laughs> and burning them up, are you? One day I might say something really important. I ordered you something. Are you ready? Arrives today down your chimney. There's some deadly fish. Midlife crisis mitigator. Drink two glasses before bedtime, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> it's a wooden spoon and some fragile china, I think is the next one I want. Egg pack. Uh, the egg goes with the spider sack. Do you like your new curtains? They're so pretty. Nothing like a well-decorated home. But don't worry. They are fireproof. Love sugar plums. Well, burn sugar plums later. <laughs> 24 bucks. Uh, let's see here. Mystery season. Season the order of a, at your next mass ball. Orders, yeah, whatever it is. Uh, yeah, it's by the coffee and the, the midlife crisis mitigator. Right, so eggs. Put the eggs in. All the eggs. Break them all. Then burn them. Gotta make those omelets somehow. There's dinnerware. I think because I broke all the eggs before I could actually do the egg sack combo. Yeah, 
Yeah. Oh no, there's a locust egg. For the Dairy Gourmand. There's even a toaster. Magic mushrooms. Freaked out food. The all the ones with googly eyes, I think. Easter bunny is egg plus bunny. Wake up combo, I think is. Should I want wake up uh, combo is? I'll put the midlife crisis mitigator in there. You just kind of have to do that. Ew! I saw a bug. You send me an exterminator, okay, thanks. I don't know, I can't remember what she wants. I think it's a... Yeah, put those eggs in there, put some seasoning on them, and some coffee. Then burn it. Super juice of 4,000. Use any high household item for a healthy snack. This one is a smoke detector. If you so wish. <laughs> in a china shop is our oh, liquid diet has the uh, is all everything that like juice so I think it's future fears midlife crisis mitigator and one more and I think it's the juicer it's not it might be oh. yeah that's the only thing that makes sense <coughs> Easter Bunny! Get a wooden spoon for that one. Oh no, I see all the liquid diet is now. So we've got coffee as well as midlife crisis mitigator. Here, have a spoon. Beat them to death. Exterminator. Okay. I don't have an exterminator. Oh. Toy exterminator. Let's use one of my express shipping stuff. Put the coffee in there, all the future fears, and a midlife crisis mitigator, and then burn it all. Liquid diet. Two, three. Oops, I missed. There's a little bug. Come here, little, little buddy. Okay, we're friends now. He loves me, smooch. Oh, he laid an egg. Well, time to burn you. Okay, he's burned. What next? Uh... There's also coffee and dry ice cubes. Um, 
don't remember what the rest the rest of them are, sadly. See the thing, the com the combos are actually very strange. Um, it the, it will give you like items across both catalogs, which may not tell you anything. They have some iced coffee. So one of the other ones here is uh, bear. I need a kitty. Uh, and then one of them is Fine China. And. Oh, I need the blowfish. Cereal and the corn on the cob. Catfish and the bear in the china shop. Just need the wake up. A couple more combos. Got the wake up, which is coffee. Coffee in a long clock. Yeah, I thought as much. And the last one doesn't make much sense, mostly because of how it's portrayed. You kind of have to keep in mind what screams in terms of food. So it's the marshmallows, the coffee, and the toaster. Yes, that will make sense somewhere. Also, that toast cannot get out of the toaster. It's on fire. <laughs> See what it was going to consider as a, a good, healthy meal for this. You got uh, some dead skunks. <laughs> oh, coffee and alarm clock. By a smoke detector, which I'm going to hurry to be here, which cost me five tickets. Yeah, get the smoke detector in that phone. Right. It's fine. Your house isn't on fire. Walker says, "Smoky with blah, smoky with a chance of thick nasal discharge." Chimney smoke and smokestacks, as far as the eye can see. Pulling from the weather balloon over the smokestacks, over the city. The weather balloon. Right, time to wake up. Let's wake Kafka up. Here's the alarm clock and the coffee. I don't have enough money for the next... <laughs> for the next one. Something here has not burned yet. There it is. Oh look, there's a facsimile of imitation meat boy. Tastes like cardboard. There's a world of goo combo. Uh, 
tetraminos. Just buy everything that's made of wood. <clears throat> Automatically short oral words in three carat or less long. Yeah, just put the phone in there. And the boss guy. Look at him. Look at him in his stupid pompadour. And also his eyes keep tracking me. Just gonna... Eesh. Or easy. Here's, here's all this shit. And, uh, here's, here's all these tetraminos. Unfortunately, I don't think it's going to give me a Tetris. And let's burn it. Like, thankfully, none of the combos have to be bigger than three. So. Oh, and there's a fucking jet reference here. I, I think I've made this reference before. A giant spider appears. You attempt to flee. Giant spider attacks for massive damage. That's the fucking Genji Days of Blade. Bullshit. They attack the giant enemy crab for massive damage. Oh, there goes a spider. Oh, this is uh, fire from Game & Watch. Oh, we'll put a uh, meat boy on the fire, it's fine. Here's all your tiny children. You want a sandwich? Me! You know what else? Bazillions of years ago, when billions of Trillions of little particles spewed into the cosmos. Entire galaxies formed like snowballs. And these distant stars and suns caught on fire. After billions of years and billions of miles, a teensy number of particles all got stuck together and created you and me. A little war right between us. It seems impossible, but it did happen. They also created this delicious ham sandwich. Thank you for your salty cosmic particles, Mr. Pig Scree. You taste like progress. You'll hear a sugar plums, nom nom nom. Right, time to burn your laser. And me, boy. <laughs> a phoenix egg. Make great omelettes. Pants have been discovered. Please remain calm. It's fine, everything's on fire anyway. On Phoenix egg. Give me my Phoenix egg. There it is. Put that in there with some other eggs. It's fine. I'm sure, those eggs won't do anything. Oh, one well, Excellent combo found. Don't think it's on far enough. Uh, ge gentleman Adventure Doll. Zombie. We've got a cardboard side. Take this, it's dangerous outside. There's the world of goo one. Hmm. 
Rambo even is. Yes, there's a lot of like clever little references in this game. <laughs> All right, I need tetraminos for you. Tetraminos there. Twisty fishy. Oh, there's casual game. to point out that you're setting fire to things without any way of actually lighting anything, so you're just doing this with your fingers. Typing new letters and I don't have a delete button. It fell off. You know what I love more than anything? Blank pages. They can be filled with anything. Dinosaurs or outer space or an entire world where everything is pink. Possibilities go forward forever. But can't go ever go back. Love sugar plums. Thanks for the delete button. Which now I'm going to throw on the fire. Uh. Hold on. Bowl of goo combo. Airplane mode. I think I have any more combos I can do for the minute. Oh wait, no I do. My link sword on the fire as well. Ship me this stupid octopus. I think I can only have like 99 tickets anyway. So you may as well use some of them up if you've got them. Dangerous go alone. Throw this on the fire. A little bit of beta. I think I need the pixel pack. Tiny galaxies. The fate of their worlds is in your hands. Gravity Boy action toy. It'll kill you five times before you hit the ground. Okay. Not all, not alone, you know. 
The city is filled with people. No, they are. See the chimney, smell the smoke. There are more people than I can count. I want to visit everyone and ask billions of questions. Where did you come from? What did you always want to be? What's your favorite smell? But even though they are everywhere, they are far away like little burning galaxies. With these little smoky chimneys on their heads. Oh, it makes me so cold. I'll always have you, smooch. Sugar plums. Right, time to burn your letter again. Give me the money from it. Uh, I need tiny galaxies because this is the only thing that's not really anything. There you go. Just, uh, just have fun with that. Kind of, you know, just put these in here. All of these in here. Oh, one of them exploded. Oh, never mind. Uh, sushi. There you go. There's a day discount sushi. And now I've got to wait for money. Meta combo. Oh fuck, did the pixel use squares get destroyed before anything happened? There we go. She ninja. With a zombie. And a pie wood. I mean, it's kind of blurry on screen, it's fine. The, ro the robots can go first. You know, they, they probably have nipple clamps. They can burn. I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. Right, a zombie, a ninja, a pirate, and some sushi. Make with that what you want. Something might be on far back there. Gravity boy, action toy. Get your ass here now, so I can burn you. His special power is attraction. And now he's dead. Right, time to buy magazine five. Look at how many combos just get unlocked from number five. The clouds are circling, it's getting windy out there. But the wind isn't blowing east or west, or north or south. It's blowing up, 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 up. Stay warm down there. Pointing for the weather balloon over the smokestacks, over the city. Weather man. Well, time to burn you. <laughs> time to burn that. Give me the small amount of gas that that will give me. Now I'm all like howling coyote. Ask whom for not coyote coyote howls. He howls for you. Uh, you know, I've played worms in my time. Let's put the, the the old lady out of her misery. Let's make her explode. <laughs> burn, lady, burn!
And I think this is the point now... Yeah, this is the point where most of the combos don't make any sense, so you have to kind of like... Even if you did figure it out, it's just not gonna happen. Okay, I missed a trick here. Oh, I already burned the book, that's why. Uh, we'll put the nesting dolls in there, let's just burn them, it's fine. I play with my little infernal fireplace, I have so much fun. I stare into the fire for hours and days. This is all the time gone. It floats up up the chimney. Up up up. Like everything else. But thanks for your letter. I'm gonna burn it. Terrible mystery combo. And the casual adventure doll. Uh, I need a little bit more money than that to do the old la the one of the other combos, elderly couple. I get the cat in here before anything else happens? I am going to suspect no. Because the old lady's still on fire. Oh, there we go. This is fine. And now I need the moon. This tiny moon. Uh, where did that wolf go? <laughs> there it is. I don't think I can do any more mini combos for the minute. Oh, I can. Uh, I need a fragile light bulb. There it is. Uh, need you and the Russian dolls. Just to hurry things along a little bit. Change the bulb combo. Uh, what was the other one? I don't have enough for the Valkyrie yet, do I? Valkyrie is expensive. 15. I need a little bit more. Yep, and then uh, just throw this all on the fire. There's a writer's block combo. Here's some, like, uh, you know, just portraits. Fuck it. Framed! Why is Solar Cell dressing up as an axe turtle? Because Solar Cell. That's it. That's the only answer I've got here. I don't care.
Bye! Oh, do I have to do the combo again because it didn't take? Or is it just being slow about it? It might be slow being slow about it. Nope, it did not do it in time. So I have to buy another Valkyrie. Fire extinguisher. Let's pair that with the smoke detector. Stop, drop, and roll, folks. Oh. Valkyrie's back in stock. Gotta wait for the action boy for his stocking. One minute. What's up there? Up out of the chimney. Oh, it swirls in my head. Like smoke. Crush that tiny little beetle. It's just sat up there and burned the letter. Thank you for my money back. Uh, that's still restocking. Here's Scarecrow. Balloons. Triangle Isle. I think every other one is... Requires things that I haven't got yet. Balloons. A potpourri bomb. Well, there's a power barrel. Barrel with some zesty beetles <laughs> and some redevelopment. Colorful flame. Burn the potpourri bomb. We've made everything just kind of stop. There's a cocoon. Flowers to go with it. I said I could try and beat this in one stream. Never mind. <laughs> and where's the cat? Nice. Why is the fire sensitive? Because it has extra stuff added to it, okay? It's mostly because there's the, um, this beta disc, where is it? This, Inferno beta, um, that just starts making stuff go weird. Uh, the scarecrow doesn't do anything. I'm sorry, I got too excited. Excuse me while I, like, 
do weird stuff here. Put the cocoon in there with the, the flower patch. There you go, have fun with that. Screw you, little bot. Uh, and then put like the fine china in here, which will break or set on fire. Here's the cat, and we'll wash it. And then burn everything. It's fine. like melody is oh right yeah next one's kind of weird the fire flickers with possibilities I wonder what happens if I get a little closer Might be setting yourself. Oh, it's fine. Oh, I need the Valkyrie again and the moon. Get the idol. It just gets to the point where you used to start like flinging all your like extra speedy tickets on it. And then you just kind of burn everything here, there we go. Orchestral. Not correct, there we go, there's Moonlight Melody. Mommy medication! Everything's sort of like going around in this orbit. Not everything has burned yet. Turn around. Behind you. A warm fire in front. What's behind? Just turn your head. Could you? If you wanted. It's staring into the fire forever, but not backwards. She's being weird. Let's just burn, burn her letter. She means nothing. And like the late stages of this game, it literally just becomes, hey, let's uh, just spend all our tokens that ships everything to us fast, so we can get on with it. Scarecrow can go in there. Okay. Mommy's medicated with extra pills and wine. She needs to drink. Oh, that was all the commas. Whoops. Uh, get this spontaneous combustion doll and uh, freezing ring light. I haven't done this over yet. Yeah, I think it'll be stopping soon, because... Like, this just went from a stream which I thought, you know what, I'll just play one game, to it fell apart, and now I'm playing a game that I've already played before. <laughs> My house is on fire! That can't be good. It hurts my eyes. I can see forward forever. Up up the chimney. Well, she's got looping. Well, not. And even the curtains are burning.
Oh, never mind. I'm sure that means nothing. <laughs> the cloud went to space. Just need to buy the snow globe, and I'm done. Burn the snow globe. It's fine. Frosty is okay, children. 340. Holy fuck. Dynamite Daisy, old bear trap. Mighty mustache. Look at that. Fucking mustache. Still one category left. But it's fine. So yeah, that's that's Little Inferno. I do actually, I do recommend it just like checking out for its weirdness alone. But there you go. Uh, tomorrow will be Yakuza, so, yep, get ready for me to start running around. Wolf stash. <laughs> so, uh, get ready for me to start running around, trying to finish chapter 6. Um, tonight was a, like, a relaxed night. Unlimited Saga will be back next week. Uh... And then, I don't know what's after that. And then it should the um, that my schedule should return to normal the week after. Um, I I think yeah, it should do. I think everything's kind of settled back down. Uh. Okay, let's send you all over to someone. Like, I'm, I'm sad that I'm sorry they had to like go into. Um, I like, had to uh, like abruptly end a bunch of stuff, but you know sometimes streams don't go the way that you want, and I'm just gonna have to put up with that occasionally. Right, I'll send you all over to someone, and I will see you tomorrow for Yakuza.